Ronan, I brought her you seek. Taldir, my sister. Would that there was time for a homecoming, but dire matters demand our attention. Surely there is a moment for a reunion. We feared the prophecy was leading us to disaster, but now I have found its form. You need to see it with your own eyes to understand. This discovery will sway Kaya? Perhaps if he was of reasonable mind. But he is a zealot. There's no telling how he will react. We must risk it. We must all see that which disturbs you so. And if Kaya still wants your head, we will take measures. I have led our people to the brink of civil war defying this prophecy. If there's even a chance, we can use what you found to open Kaya's eyes. I have to try. I feel you near, Rona. Speak to me. I long to hear your voice again. I wish there was time, sister. But darkness draws nigh. Yes. Your presence anchors me to the mortal realm as if I were still alive. And I feel the creeping and gloom as well. This is not what I wanted for you, sister. You were to be taken home, your ghost laid to rest. Perhaps when this is all over. Mighty heroes and forgotten craft worlds have been corrupted and undone by you. Here stands the wreckage of ancient Eldar shrines and idols, battlements and barricades, all sealed within a shell forged by our ancient enemy. I have known many Eldar over many generations who have fought for the Spear of Cain. Indeed, I am warring now upon these carcass-strewn battlefields. But thus far, none have claimed the spear. Why is that, Acheron? It's over here, just ahead. What is that in the ice? This is it. The shadow in my vision. A demon! It stirs. It's only a matter of time until it wakes. All the more reason to seize the spear and slay it. We can banish the shadow together. But I need Taldir to preserve our unity. I've imprisoned enough warriors for supporting you as it is. Continuing this war will surely awaken this creature. If you're set on staying this course, I must choose rebellion. You choose treason. So be 